Make a slight right onto Alabama 215 South, University Boulevard East. Continue on Alabama 215 South for one and a half miles. Um, Alabama, you know, went down there. We camped, and first thing they did was just, they greeted us, um, they showed around the whole facility. I met up with Coach um, Holman um, and Freddie Roach. Oh, 
body in front of him. Think about moving your feet and get your body in front of him. Ready, ready. Okay. Strike! Yeah. You go first, yeah. Once I get to the top, get you back. Right. 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 Keep working him for the whip. Get his ass out there. Ready, ready. Okay. <laughs> keep working. Oh, no. Alabama, definitely they're just, they're just organized, you know. If actually I need water, food, throw my trash away. Met Nick Saban the GOAT right after, right after the camp. Yeah, this is the locker room, newly renovated. It's a fun visit, you know. You had the photo shoot, you know, that was lit. I see the comments, but really I'm bothered. I know it's hurting. She's on the outside, but he won't let you lay up. All the FSP players, you know, they had the, the music playing. Goat and went in his office. It was magical. <laughs> seen, all, seen all the rings, all the trophies, all the like, all the things he had in his office. He said to me um, that I can play defense and tight end, so that really that really meant a lot. It's a lot to me. So you, you have to have. You have to have an idea, man, a true which you want. And then, man, make sure, man, that you're asking questions to sort of get you to that decision, man, to where it makes sense for you. Look, you got a lot of good questions. Relationships are secondary. How you going to be utilized has to be primary. So if, you mean, if, if you're not going to be utilized properly, but you got a great relationship, you, you're going to leave. Right? I mean, that, that, that's just what it is nowadays. Because most guys are going to, down here in the South, Guys are going to school with a three-year mentality. Okay, I want to play as a freshman. Okay, I want to be, be dominant as a sophomore. I don't want to have a little junior this year. You know? So, know, so how can I get as close to my degree in three years as I can? I spent 15 years in Eastern Washington. I recruited the states for 17 years, two years in boys, and now I'm down here. I was born in Washington, so it's good to see you there for a while. That's my is. Five things we broke it down to. That's in guys we look for, we call them all our men. Everything we achieved, we did it We worked out, it's me and um, a couple of players from FSP. Watts, he's a cool, he's a cool coach, you know, very energetic, taught me a couple moves. Worked out with Dan Lanning. Go 
Northern Air. First, first thing we did was camp. Um, it was hot out there. Had about like 90 degrees plus the humidity out there. Xbox or PlayStation. I used to be a PlayStation guy. And then um, we got, we also got the uh, Nintendo Switch. A little game room, got like a little golf and little thing. Go. Everything you have is nice. This is the cryotherapy. Money Mayweather, he used cryotherapy. LeBron James. And the photo shoot, I think it's probably like one of the best photo shoots I ever did. The photographer, you know, he, he knew what he was doing. Got you, got you for me. Got Hey, thanks for coming. All right, see you soon. You gotta get out of the picture now. Get the picture. Hey, you got, you got big time potential in us. You are a lead player. We're gonna be building our relationship with you. Yeah, you got a chance to meet Coach Wayne, at least, man, and come to a
the game. We met up with Coach Freeman, you know, he showed us around the facilities and all that. Michigan's pretty huge. It's, it's huge. The stadium was it, was, it was, it was big. It's like the two things. Desmond doing the highs and post in the end zone changed everything. And then basketball, Fat Five, where, you know, the baggy shorts, the black socks changed everything. <laughs> You seen all the all the equipment they have in there, all the, the massages and all that. So Summit's going on right now, so I think the offensive line one is in like Wyoming. The big boys wanted some comfort, so they going to chill on somebody's ranch somewhere. You want to check out what the uh, cool top in here? Real quick, eyes up. Step one. 
Now banana. Now we're downfield. some motion we're gonna work on all of our silver and gold stuff okay listen when we go if it goes empty we're going special cloud we're just trying to get a chip in this guy's rib and we want to get right back. So he can get in there. Oh, good, Jay. Way too good. Oh, good, oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. Just, just hopes you just strike, strikes your opponent, you know, just getting off the ball faster. And just watching the ball. It's the most important thing too. That's that's pretty hard, you know. Your legs hurting. Hey, you gotta be more violent. Good, good. Go. Good, Jamie Wade. Out of boy. Out of boy. Oh, go, 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 go. 
He's funny, he's a jokester, you know, but he can be hard on you too. All my other coaches can be hard, but they're pretty cool coaches, you know. And just like I said, they, they love you. you know, they want the best for okay. you. Let's go. Um, I need to give me. You hop over here. Stay. Summer camp for for Lincoln, Coach D Way. He runs he runs the whole thing for the defensive line. You know, he's a cool guy. You know, he, he can be he can be hard sometimes, but you know, he just he just showing that because he loves you. Yeah, he he been my coach since freshman year. And um, he really just helped me out a lot, you know, just you know, throughout freshman year, just giving the plays, you know. He's seen something in me, that's why that's why I started freshman year. So he's seen a lot of potential I had. I'm just really just working hard, you know, being at every practice. I was never, never late. There's this thing called the football. In the offensive line, they cheat. They're probably two yards deep. And you need to be able to take two steps so we can get our jam and read it. I shouldn't be having to tell you how to line up 20 practices in. It's your team. It's your team. Tell them to line up right. This has got to be a great period. Be fast, play fast. Alley Whack Productions. Hey, it's Green Ohio. Hey. This is you. This is you. Where are you? This is you. Hey, if these holes go away, you got to go with them. Right? Hey, 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 hey. Coach Masamoto, you know, he's our head coach for Lincoln. He's very quiet. He likes to watch what you're going to do. You know, he's strict, but, you know, like I always said, he, always, he loves you guys, you know. So he always, that's what he always preaches, you know. He's hard, he's a hard coach. He's very organized. Double break. Okay. Here's the team, double break. All right, helmets off, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, guys. Thanks, guys. Obviously, tomorrow we'll have our seven on seven run through. It's just for the seven on seven guys who are traveling, okay? Uh, yeah. Right, uh, so listen. <laughs> right now, we're gonna uh, have a quick coaches meeting. And then going on Saturday, you do need a waiver form, okay? So you can bring it tomorrow, or lineman, you obviously have to bring it Saturday morning. Oh, 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 I didn't really have any goals. I was really just really just trying to have fun because I didn't really know too much about football. Just out there having fun, you know. Just like I said, scoring, scoring, I'm scoring touchdowns. You know, that was that was just fun to me. You know, just having fun with my my brothers just out there, just making new friends. So when I first started playing, I think it was like third grade. I played for um, the Bellarmine Lions. You know, they call me on, they call me Baby Megatron. As you see, I got my guy Calvin Johnson right here. You know, the goat right here, Red receiver, autographing everything. Bunch of touchdowns. I played DN too, getting sacked, just really just having fun out there. That yeah, football was my first love. I mean, my, my brother got me into that, Deshaun. So, you know, he just taught me uh, without him, I wouldn't be in this position. So, he really, he really inspired me to play. The reason why I went to Lincoln was because my dad went there, um, my, uh, my auntie, my uncle went there, my grandpa. So it's just it's just in the family, you know. I remember just playing tackle football in the living room with him. So he really just toughened me up, so I could just play against the other dudes, you know. Really just 
we just kept on pushing them. He just taught me everything. Every time you went to the field, I went to the field. Every time you went to the basketball court, I went to the basketball court. Just remember, just playing one-on-one, him just getting me better and all that. Don't care about the mistakes, just, just get it out your mind. You know, um, really just stay humble, work hard, even when no one's watching and all that. You know, we play different positions, but I mean, it's really just footwork and agility and speed and all that. Just me knowing that, um, like, I could just be, I could be good at um, defense and, I mean, Brandon Huffman told me that. Um, I should stick to DN and all that, so I really just stuck out with it. So I got my first offer from Oregon. I was, I was shocked. I didn't know I, didn't know I was going to get the offer. I mean, um, Mario, Mario, Mario Cristobal called me back, you know, we talked, we chalked it up, you know, and he said, I'm going to just give you an offer. Because he, was, he was watching me going to the one-on-ones. It, it, it definitely changed my mindset. I just kept on working and working, so yeah, that's when I realized I was good. I was that guy. I was going against older, older cats and I, I wasn't, I was a hooper. Excel. Played all the positions. Highest points I ever scored was like 38 points in the game. That was in sixth grade. So that was like one, one of my best memories. And I got my um, my first offer was in eighth grade from Oregon. Then like three months passed. Um, I got my second offer from Tennessee. You know, I was I was pretty excited for that one. These are, these are the, the mail they sent me. So yeah, my recruitment really picked up like um, after um, my freshman season, you know, getting calls from every coach, you know, text messages. I remember my coach, Coach Matt, really just hitting me up every like almost like every day. So this, is, this is my wall here. Got all my lanyards, all my achievements, I my earned. So got my first offer. So I really started with the Oregon offer. So I just really started collecting all the lanyards. So here got my MVP trophy. I won from from the FBU All American game. So I won the MVP. The news article right here. Uh, it's my like my first one, so this is pretty. This is pretty big for me. So how Wayne became the next big star for Lincoln, for Lincoln High School football. So that really meant a lot. Kobe mentality. You know, I just grew up watching him. Just, he, he's inspired me. You know, this this Mamba mentality. One, one of the greatest of all time. I'm a big anime guy. Got my got my little bobblehead like Dragon Ball Z anime characters right there. Vegeta, Piccolo. That's pretty cool. Alabama, LSU, Florida, got from Michigan. First time making saving, it's the, the picture I took with him, so really just um, cherished the moment, you know. I still go himself, so these all the rings, I was just sitting in front of me, so. The all, all American game, freshman All American ball. It's my jersey, just hung up on the plat, and that's when I went on. Um, I'm um, just the MVP of the of the whole game, so that's, that's a big that's a big achievement for me. So, so yeah, for Florida, you know, went down there, they, they showed us around and all that. Um, met Coach Miller, the head coach for Florida. You know, he's a, he's a cool guy. He's funny. Got the and all that. I said this is the most important room because like I said, your money. the media is who makes you a Hall of Famer. So a lot of our schools are sick on our things and then I feel like there's the pythons for instance, they took over the Everglades and they're killing all the animals so they have a hunting season to get rid of the pythons. Those are called invasive species. You got lizards like that and stuff. Meditation, 
look at some of those names. Look, Andre Johnson, Brian Kenny, Reggie Wayne. This is our song now. <laughs> this is University of Miami's song. Like, our players take this song, like, personal. I saw the blue water. I said, man, how long you all the time? photo shoot and talking with Coach Simpson. Uh, my last Coach Simpson's down here with these guys in the photo shoot. So I'm gonna see, we're gonna head down and we'll see if the jersey's ready. If not, we'll do it. Life is what you make it. I feel like a man's at. I can't see a way out. I've been stacking face down off canvases. I painted. I just spent the rain. <laughs> Guys, have any questions, comments, or concerns? Nothing? Yeah, yeah you guys are just.